evening everyone. Friday, November 27, 2020. Available to day 11. Number 1335. Apparently I'm just adding up playing the vlog from yesterday, so by the time you're watching this video, yesterday's vlog should already be up. Please be sure to go check it out. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Um, I had to go get water um, from Walmart today, and I saw that they had this foot-long turkey cheddar, so I had to get it. Um, and that's pretty much what I ate today. I also bought some colas. And I had a cola with my sub or whatever sandwich. And then um, it was just turkey with cheese, lettuce, um, and like on a whole wheat bun. Um, and what else did I get from there? I got that. I got those three things. Um... And ooh, I got some chocolate. Totally forgot about it. I got some um, of this Ferrero Rocher. So I'm gonna have some because I've just been like on some Ferrero Rocher so much. So I'm gonna have some of this now, I guess. I completely forgot about it. Dude, I love turkey so much. I cannot get enough. Like, I literally, the reason that I bought the turkey sandwich that I bought at Walmart is because I am constantly craving turkey. Um, because, like, universally everybody in the States only eats it on Thanksgiving. You know what I mean? Um, and so. <laughs> It's like your yearly turkey ration. <laughs> anyway, so, um, um, and like, I don't, like, the reason that I got my turkey sandwich today is because I, um, was thinking in my head when I was looking, um, that I don't, I stopped going to Jimmy John's for their turkey tom. I mean, it's literally like um, sacrilege or something. That's it. End of joke. Turkey is actually like a really amazing food. Um, because it actually makes me want to eat more of it. There's no other food that I do that with other than turkey. Um, which is kind of delightful because um, I like having the feeling of wanting to eat in that sense, like in that sort of healing sense. You know what I'm saying? Um, anything turkey like you know, like, well, chicken pot pie is really, really good too, though. Um, but there's, there's like another dish that only has turkey in it, um, that's made of turkey that I really like too, but I can't think of what it is. For now, um, the turkey is the subject on hand here, people. So, um, or the sandwich, yeah. So, I like that, but I would, I would like to have more of it for sure. Um, obviously. <laughs> I don't think it's very fattening. It's like really lean. You know, it's like really good for you. Turkey and gravy, which I love too. Um, but yeah. Um, I got the one sandwich and I felt like it was kind of obscene. 
like that I was eating a foot long all to myself. Um, in and of itself. Um, because I thought maybe it would be like too much food or something, but it totally wasn't. I mean, it is straight up like lean protein that goes straight to your gut muscles. You know what I'm saying? Dude, it is so legit. Um, I mean, it's not like crazy or anything, but... Um, and then like for the whole rest of the day, I wanted to eat another one, but I still thought it would be a little bit obscene <laughs> to go back to Walmart just for a sandwich. I'm gonna warm up some chicken corn soup for myself. Cause that's protein and it's poultry. It's poultry, baby. It's damn close to turkey. Tastes almost just like turkey. It's not quite turkey, but like furkey. Fake turkey, is that a thing? I was actually thinking faux turkey, which is, a, which is a thing. It's obviously probably made of tofu, right? And tastes like turkey. I don't know, probably, I'm sure. There, there's something like that out there. But this doesn't taste nearly like turkey at all. It's literally been raining nonstop all day. I can't believe there's that much water. <laughs> it's because of where I live, that was a, that was a joke. Okay, just because it doesn't rain. It's practically like a freaking rainforest. The tropics. So I got my crust here. I'm gonna eat this with my, I'm gonna try to eat it with um, my soup. I am, I am. I'm going to try. I think it would be too many carbs though. Um, Cause it already has that wheat starch in it. Um, and yeah, I don't know. Um, but I don't know. It's supposed to serve as like, you know, that little add, add in to your soup. So I got sort of a funny story for you. It's not really that funny. You shouldn't really laugh, but um, it's very serious. So I'm driving to Walmart. It's raining. Okay, the, the roads are very slick. If you live in Houston or if you're around the area and you saw the weather today, you're driving down the street, you know what I'm talking about. Very slick. I approached this red light <laughs> and I don't even reach to the line uh, to, to, to fully brake. And I look across and there's this white van. It's one of those large, you know, three tier white vans. Um, it's just like a utility van, you know? So this vehicle is in the opposite, like inner, uh, in the, in th at the red light um, in front of me, right? And it's making a left onto the street that I'm on. So it makes a left and I'm listening to that song, Makura Swag, if you don't know what it is, you need to go look it up. I'm listening to it and I'm just like, cause it's a bop, you know, it's my song. Um, and it's, it's, it's the hit right now. So, the car, okay, as he pulls, <laughs> and I'm just like jamming out or whatever, slowly approaching it. Uh, I, I look up and I see this car and he's making a left onto the street that I'm about to uh, cross the, the red light and, you know, go down. And <clears throat> what do you call it? So then I look... I look up for a second and I continue to like look down and just, you know, focus. And I look up again and the car has now completely turned. Uh, <laughs> it must have like slipped or something happened. But the, the car has completely turned sideways. Here's the road. The car is like this on the road. <laughs> And then there's this car that was right behind him trying to follow him to make the left as well that stops. Thank goodness there wasn't a collision. 
and the the white van had completely slipped and done one of these like almost um, like a full 180 you know and its back end is towards the curb um, on the other end or the other like end of the street and I start cracking up dude I have never seen anything <laughs> happened before my eyes and I could not stop laughing that was so funny I felt so bad for the guy because so oh my god because like it was funny like I laughed because like nobody got hurt right it would have sucked if there would have been a, an accident then it would have sucked you know then I would have been like not in a in such a laughy mood but that was so funny it almost looked like a practical joke I mean the car just slips and goes like this and so then it's like the front of it is actually then facing the vehicle behind it <laughs> uh, and I think they probably saw me laughing they I don't know but it was they I, I think he was able to like straighten out so he did another full or like a half circle and just kind of left turned onto the street to straighten out his vehicle. <laughs> He continued. Quiet Prince, the internet is listening. Anyways everyone, I'm going to close the vlog. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys on the next vlog.